Welcome to Wisdom for the Day. This is your daily dose of insight and inspiration, where we explore the timeless wisdom of the book of Proverbs. Each episode is a short five-minute journey covering two Proverbs, in order, guiding you through the entire book in a year. Join us for thoughtful reflections and practical advice to enrich your life and elevate your day. Wisdom for your day starts now. Today is day 296. We're in the 25th chapter of the book of Proverbs, verses 14 through 16, from the New Living Translation. A person who promises a gift but doesn't give it is like clouds and wind that bring no rain. Patience can persuade a prince, and a soft speech can break bones. Do you like honey? Don't eat too much, or it will make you sick. In verse 14, people in hot, dry lands know the disappointment of seeing clouds but not getting any rain. It's the same kind of disappointment when someone promises something that doesn't follow through with it. Children especially get excited about gifts and feel extra let down when they don't receive them. Verse 15 tells us that confronting someone angrily isn't the best way to change their mind. Wise, thoughtful words are more likely to have a positive outcome. Verse 16 encourages moderation. Can you have too much of a good thing? Absolutely. Too much honey can make you sick. Too much attention can make someone feel smothered. Too much power can make you lose sight of others' needs. Think about this. When you make promises to children, do you always follow through? To God, promises made to children are just as important as promises made to adults. Well, that wraps up today's episode, but come back tomorrow to pick more of King Solomon's brain. For some free Wisdom of the Day merch, visit buymeacoffee.com forward slash renewed mindsets. While you're there, don't forget to join our community as a member. The executive producer of Wisdom for the Day is Yelena McClellan. The co-producer and spiritual advisor is Kimmy Shirley. Intro and outro music by Weston McCurry. If you enjoyed the show, spread the word and share it with a friend. Until next time, I'm Rick. I love you. See ya. Hey, let me ask you, do you ever feel defeated as a Christian in these times we live in today? Well, I have a podcast for you. God's Loving Sacrifice. My friend Gayla does a Bible study to help you strengthen your walk with the Lord in today's crazy world. She encourages you to share the gospel and the love of Christ with a world in need. So listen at GodsLovingSacrifice.com or whatever podcast app you use. God's Loving Sacrifice, the true essence of faith in God.